This autumn, Linde introduced two new truck series, the new N20 order picking truck line and the 1202 series hydrostatic IC powered forklifts. Especially the IC series is almost 100% new developed and is now introduced in Berlin. As you know, we're introducing several trucks on one hand, you know, the whole new order picker series, 24 models. Yeah, so now we have the broadest uh, order picker portfolio in the market. Yeah, that's one important thing and we all know the warehouse market is the largest segment and the fastest growing. So this is an important segment for us. On the other hand, obviously, I mean, Linde is a market leader in counterbalance trucks. So therefore, introducing now an all new counterbalance truck obviously is very, very important for us as well. I think the speciality is that we made everything new, starting from visibility over reliability, efficiency, and last but not least, connectivity, because that's the first Linde truck which is 100% connected, X-Works. Thanks to this connectivity, every truck in the new H-Series is connected to the cloud to store all relevant truck data. The cloud connection is also used for updates and remote monitoring for better service and maximal uptime. Furthermore, the new H-Series stands out for its improved step-up, increased cap space, improved visibility, easy service, higher side impact protection and new modified hydrostatic driveline. Linde claims to have the most economical and productive truck on the market. For every 1500 hours, the fuel savings are estimated to be 2000 euros. The biggest advantage is our hydrostatic drive and we improved it again because we introduced now a V plus displacement pump which has a higher volume. This is reducing the RPMs of the truck from a certain speed on and by this you are reducing consumption. With the new IC range, Linde expects to be ahead of the competition again. But given the increase within the electric truck segment, the question arises is this the last series with an IC engine that Linde is developing? To be honest, I would say yes, but it's not the last series because this truck is ready for the future. Um, that could be as well, yeah. Uh, but right now we do see for the next 10 years still a need for um, IC trucks. Yeah. Um, the interesting thing is the share of the market is actually declining. Yeah but we have seen in the last years that the overall volume is still increasing. So we will be able that this, to update this truck at any time. We can put new software on this truck. For sure, if a new exhaust legislation comes, we will have to do something, but then we do not develop a new truck. We will update this truck and we will keep it running as long as it takes.